Welcome guys to episode 517 of Minecraft and I'm using the Extended Workbench mod. So the name of the mod is called the Extended Workbench mod and uh, the way you extend your workbench, see this is a normal workbench and if you extend it, you can see it's sort of like a double chest, sort of like a double crafting bench and uh, you can see that if we press O, you can see that it is extended and you got the double sort of workbench to create epic items. Now you see here, here is the crafting grid and it used, this mod is well thought out. It uses all of the crafting grid to actually create a tool. So uh, the, the sort of, um, the way you craft them is by using a, um, it sort of depends on each block. The forum thread nicely shows with pictures how to craft most of all, or basically all the items. And uh, you, all you do is you, uh, to create a stone pickaxe, an extended stone pickaxe, you craft it like this and uh, to create a sort of diamond. And if you hold shift it, shoo, uh, and click, shift click to go down, down to inventory it goes down to the next grid that could be fixed but uh, let's go craft the awesome diamond sword so this is how you craft the diamond sword it's purely epic um, you can see the extended diamond sword it would be um you sort of would think that uh, you'd place another iron ingot here, but uh, unfortunately you don't. You place it like this to create the extended diamond sword. And uh, all these tools have special abilities, and uh, not special abilities, but uh, more like 100% um, better, they're 100% faster, or they have 100% more uses, or even 100 or 50% more damage. So now I'm going to do a time trial between the stone pickaxe and the extended stone pickaxe. So you can see that the extended pickaxe is a lot faster and in the mod forum it does show that um, these blocks or these tools, the actual um, the shovel, the, the pickaxe, the axe, the hoe and also the sword, they're 100% faster, they're 50% more damage if it's used as a weapon and also 100% more uses. So uh, using the extended pickaxe is really good. Now, of course, it also modifies some tools such as a bow and arrow, a fishing rod, a flint and steel, um, the maps, and also shears. So you can see that the um, bow and arrow is actually 50% faster, 50% more uses, and 20% uh, longer to charge um, because you get the extra power of the red string, and uh, the red string is really brutal. So if you charge your bow for an extra four seconds, it turns, the string turns red and it means that it's supercharged and it flies twice as fast and uh, does damage, a lot of damage. Also, you get your standard fishing rod, which uh, allows you to catch fish faster, more uses and, and the stuff like that. See, you already got a fish, threw out, threw out another hook and uh, we'll, we'll most likely get another fish. See, it's a lot faster and uh, it has more uses. It's sort of the same deal with the flint and steel and also the shears. The fire is uh, twice as strong, so uh, it burns twice as, uh, twice as long and the flint and steel has more uses uh, along with that. Uh, along with the shears, and um, I'm going to delete that, oh, break the fire, because uh, I know what happened with fires, and you can see that uh, it breaks a lot faster, and uh, you have a lot more uses with it. Also, the maps have been modified, and you can see in my bottom uh, inventory, you can see that there are this sort of stacked maps, and if you press, if you have a keyboard with a number pad, you can press your, press your plus and minus keys to enlarge the map. All right, so you can enlarge it into five different layers, and uh, I'm over here, and uh, if we go set speed, and we'll set it to 10, and uh, you can just go flying around with my map. There we go, we'll uh, change it to creative mode, and you can just fly around, zip, zuppity, booping all, all around your map, and you can press minus, and you can see that uh, it's a pretty big map, and uh, if you zoom in, you can see that uh, if we try and zoom in, hopefully we're going the right way, no we're not. Now we are, okay, now we are. If we zoom in all the way, I'll see myself. There we go, look, look at me. I'm a, I'm a nice little indicator, I'm doing like drifts. Drifts around my map. So I've pretty much covered everything this mod has to entail and uh, also it has modified the um, armor so you can have more uses and uh, more damage can be ensued into the armor before it breaks. So uh, I rate this mod a 9 out of 10 Fruit Loops. I really like this mod. It, it really had a great idea of conjoining the uh, two crafting tables and uh, it, it implemented new tools into a more 
cooler way. It uh, sort of implemented tools that uh, could be actually um, used and, and it's not just implementing um, a crafting recipe to create the epic sword but uh, actually using the extended space to create a better tool so I really like that idea and uh, that's good thinking by the mod developer. So uh, thank you guys for watching, don't forget to rate, comment and subscribe and uh, have a nice day.